News at 11. Hi, and thanks for staying up late with us. I'm Rob Manco. The Jackson County, West Virginia School Board is considering a new position to help enhance school safety. Now, this is in response to concern from parents and students. 13 News reporter Lane Ball has more on what they're doing. Recently, a hot button item for the school district has been school safety. Now, last meeting, the idea of possibly expanding the school's shield program was first introduced. And tonight, the Jackson County Sheriff's Office requested they add a new position. Last April, the Jackson County School District had a close call when a student brought a firearm on a bus, which was quickly handled when another student alerted the driver. But since then, parents have been voicing concerns over student safety in the schools. In an effort to ensure these students feel safe in the school district, Superintendent William Hossafluke, after talking with Jackson County Sheriff Rosh Mellinger, suggested they expand their SHIELD program, starting with the addition of a program coordinator. Retired Ravenswood Police Officer Tom Tom Spies is expected to take on the title. He says one of his goals is to use the position to make himself available to students and staff if a dangerous situation were to arise. Any information that has come to us or come to any agency in this county more than likely has come from a kid, a concerned kid that has said something to a teacher, myself, someone in that building. With these kids, they're the eyes and ears. This will be in collaboration with the Jackson County Sheriff's Office to ensure that dangerous situations are dealt with as soon as possible. And unfortunately, Sheriff Ross Mellinger says it's becoming more of a necessity every day. Complacency will get your kids killed. And ignorance will make you famous. And if those two were ever to align in the perfect storm, um, Jackson County would be in a very, very dark place. In addition to this new position, Sheriff Mellinger says their hope is to move quickly with getting this approved and to eventually have code red alarms installed in every school, along with training for students and also be able to bring in more officers in the schools. The Jackson County School Board will be discussing this subject further at their next meeting. Reporting in Ripley, Lane Ball, 13 News.